Hey guys, we just made it to the Chuki fish market, the traditional Japanese fish market. We're going to try some fish over here and see all the fresh fish that they have on display. It's going to be great. Let's go. Hello. Uh, I would like a squid, please. With this one? Yeah. Yeah, thank you. So six, uh, 600, 600 yen. Okay. So you want to choose beef? Uh, what's the small one? Small one? Yeah. Okay, 2000 yen. Yeah, 2600. 2600. Yeah. I'm going to give you a five. Thank you. And oh. 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 <coughs> Very close to fall. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank Thank you. 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 Thank so I got the, the squid over here and uh, Wakobi beef. Um, never tried Wakobi beef in my life, so uh, this is gonna be tasty. And uh, the squid, <laughs> I just get, got to have it. Let's sit over here. Try it. Yeah, I'm gonna try the squid first. Chewy, but very nice. Look at this thing. It's crazy. Mmm. It was not cheap, I think it was 30 euros, but uh, gotta try it, of course. And the Wakobi beef. Oh my gosh, that just melts on your tongue. Mm. That's lovely. Yeah. Okay, let's finish it. Japan is also very famous for its uh, perfect fruits. You can see here white strawberries. Are these uh, cherries or what is it? 12,000 yen, that's $120 for cherries. It's crazy. Or are those? those are also expensive. Oh yeah. 7,000 yen or what is it, 800 yen? No, oh, that's, that's okay, that's like eight euros. But uh, wow, over there you got these mangoes. I want to try one of those. Yeah. But not, not too expensive, not a very expensive one because gotta watch the money a little bit. But uh, I'm gonna try one of these white strawberries, I think. Let's look around and find some. Got myself some white strawberries, white and red strawberries. The red we are used to, but the white, do they taste the same? Exactly the same. Just the color. Just the color. But it's nice, look at it. Genetically modified strawberries in Japan. Crazy. Lovely. So guys, we're now making our way to a, a sushi joint and uh, we are gonna have a lesson in uh, making sushi. So it's gonna be awesome, I think. Look at this traditional Japanese street that we're walking through. You got all these little sushi joints on the side here. It's crazy. Normally it should be on the left over there. Yeah, that's it. It's an Airbnb experience. Never tried it. It's uh, first time that I'm booking an Airbnb experience. And uh, let's see over here. It should be, yes, this is it. Let's go in. It's the sushi joint. See the name over here, Sushi Yashigo. Do you know uh, which side we need to wait on the escalator on the Tokyo? Left. Left. And uh, how about in Osaka City? <laughs> Everybody been there? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, maybe. Uh, so, Billy, the answer is very simple. Right. Yeah, 
So, um, so if you go w uh, west, uh, especially on Osaka City, you need to wait on the right side on the escalator. So really different. Why? Why? Yes, we have uh, two. Uh, we have uh, two stories. First one is a fantasy story. You know, in the end period, this area, uh, Tokyo was a samurai warrior's world. So, you know, samurai warrior usually uh, wear the sword on the left hip. So, uh, samurai warrior uh, usually walk on the left side because uh, they need to protect their sword. So, if they walk in the middle, so they often hit uh, with other people and uh, as other soldiers. So start, uh, they need to start fighting. Wait your hand again, please. Wait your hand. And then next, take a big, big rice, please. Like a double chicken. Double chicken egg size. And please make it longer in your right hand. Make it long in your right hand. You can take more rice later if you need more. Yeah. Now, wet your hand again, please. Wet your hand. Okay. Now we spread the rice to the opposite end using your right hand. Okay. And uh, but one point, please leave a space on both sides, top and bottom, about uh, one centimeter each. Look, using your right hand, spread the rice to the opposite end. Make your rice flat. Yes. Okay, now we roll it. Okay. Now we roll it. But we have uh, two steps. Okay. This is step one. Look, stopping the both corner of the CV by your index fingers and then holding makis together. This is step one. Look, go around, go around, and then stop. Please stop once the edge of CV touch together. You can leave a space a little bit. Please stop once the edge of the CV touch together. Yes. This is step one. Step one. Yes. Okay. Okay. Let's check. Open your makisu. Open your makisu. Very good. Wait your knife, please. Wait your knife. Okay. Now we cut it into six pieces. First of all, cut it in the middle. Make it half piece, make it even. Don't push, move back and forth. Okay, and then once you finish, Please drop your rolls on your on your plate. Presentation again. I made this very good. Mm. Next week we will visit a famous cat cafe in Japan, the Shibuya Crossing, a cherry blossom garden and much more. So stay tuned, like, subscribe and comment and we will see you next time.